guys and welcome back to another video with me outside in game or Danny prefer and today I'm bringing you um, a short little video to show you what I am using to record my gameplay on my new laptop at the moment um, this is a program that I found so much better for live streaming and recording than fraps and uh, XSplit this is because oh there goes my mouse there we go it's back uh, that's because it's a free software and the quality is very good, as you see, may have seen in my previous video, which was the review of my Toshiba Satellite C850 and Windows 8. If you haven't seen that, make sure you go check that out. So, I'm currently using my Windows 8, blah, blah, blah. So, this is it. Open broadcast software. It's free. The link will be down in the below in the description. But I'm just going to show you a little bit of how I get it set up. So first what you want to do when you first get this is you're going to want to put scene, go to scenes, uh, right click, add scene and then whatever you want to call it. I'll call it capture just because it makes it nice and easier and then you're going to want to go over to sources and go to software capture I believe. Okay, monitor capture. It will come up with this it's a monitor capture yes you want that on unless you want the window which I, I don't know what that is but I'm gonna keep it a monitor because that just captures all of it um, and then capture mouse blah 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 so you click on that it will stay with a gray box here um, that's usual I'll come to that later so then if you want um, I can't even think what it's called now. If you want face cam, like I have been using at the moment, um, what I've been doing is I've been going over to here. I've been going to add video capture device. Um, and call it. Oh, go away! I wasn't ready for you. I wasn't ready. Hey ho. Right. So that's the webcam I use at the moment. Toshiba Web Camera HD. It's installed with the actual. Um, laptop itself so that's nice so then you click on that so it's still it's got this little area which is a bit of a bummer but hey ho right so then you're gonna want a preview screen and oh my god so that's what it looks like when you start streaming or live like uh, capturing but that's not good enough because you can't see the camera so stop preview um, you can you remove your software capture preview stream and there's me oh my god right um, yeah anyway so I'm gonna stop preview again because that's really scary and ugly but <laughs> right I'm only joking I'm beautiful so then you're gonna go on to go on to software capture again blah 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 I'll just leave it as it was and then boom but I'm still on top but that's all fine because you want to click on video capture device and you want to um oh is it that one no no bad oh that's what i'm doing you want to do that click on video capture device edit scene and then it will come up with these red outlines with the red the squares in the corner so then you can basically resize and fit it to wherever you like boom it's face cam and oh I keep on losing my mouse I've got a I'm using just this crappy old thing at the moment because um, it's really bad but because um, the other mouse I left at my dad's which is a bit stupid but what can you do so that's how you get face cam and everything it's really good quality um, I'm really liking it so now I'm gonna stop preview for a second and I'm gonna show you how to um, figure out how to get where to save it and all that stuff so if you want to you can go to broadcast settings and it will that's live stream is the default um, I'll be doing some live streaming soon so that will be all good on twitch so then you're gonna want to click on the little arrow or just on the box go to file output um, you're gonna want to press browse and basically place it wherever you like um, so mine's in recording I'm using Camtasia at the moment 
um, just because for some reason Fraps isn't working. Um, you can't actually record desktop on Windows 8, which is a bit of a bummer. But don't worry, I've got this now. If there is a little watermark up the top um, saying camtasia.co.uk, I'm really sorry for that. But there's nothing else I could do with decent quality, so... Um, so yeah, then you just want to call it whatever you like, so blah blah blah. I'm just going to cancel for now. Um, and then you're going to start hotkey. Oh, oh, clear. Go away. You got. You can have hot hot keys. What I do is I just yeah, I'd like to apply. Um, what I like to do is I just like to put play press start streaming. That will start and then stop streaming and then I just like to edit it down just so it makes it much simpler so um, that's about it guys you can also add another scene say uh, add scene and then if you're streaming just put pause for example and that sh uh, I want an image so then I could just browse for an image say in pictures obviously just might as well just put the thumbnail of the last my last video um, and then preview stream so then if I was streaming blah 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 I'm playing a game and then I was like I'll be right back in a second guys bear with me and boom I've got a picture there I don't know why it's going all weird but hey ho this is just a little um thumbnail made on Windows uh, on Microsoft Paint sorry about the black bits but that's because it's supposed to fit to the YouTube thumbnail size um, and that's about it guys if you've enjoyed this video and found it useful make sure you go check out open broadcast software I'm on version 0.47 alpha or it might be an, is that alpha it might just be A. I think it's in either alpha or beta at the moment. Um, hopefully this doesn't uh, convert to a... I've forgotten what it's called. Ho hopefully this doesn't actually uh, make become a pay to new service like XSplit because this is really good. And now I'm just going to cut to a little bit of um, gameplay just to show you what it, the, the quality is like in game. So I'll see you in a second. Alright, uh, so guys, I'm in a game of Minecraft at the moment, and as you can see, it runs nice and, and smoothly. Uh, this is just a little world that I started up when I first got the laptop. Um, this, then again, it may just be because this is a pretty beast laptop. It's got 8GB of RAM, so it can handle this. But as far as I know, it's really good uh, software. If you like, uh, make sure you go download it. The, uh, the link will be down in the description. It, like I said, I can't stress how good this software is. You can do face cam, all of that stuff. Um, so, as you can see, I'm scrolling and I'm just keeping generating a world. Um, so, yeah. If you enjoyed this little video, guys, make sure you leave a thumbs up. I'll be doing more tutorials um, in the future. Hopefully, I'll be finding some more like oh spider well let me just there we go hopefully i'll be finding more games to play um more indie games i'm also like i said i'm just gonna be trying to find some nice green like games on steam so i can play but go away there we go um also i've got pokey mmo uh surgeon simulator binding of isaac Hero Truck Simulator, which I suck at, and Hotline Miami, is to, all to come on my channel, which is really good. Um, so, guys, there's the software once again. Blah. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, peace out. Bye.